Today I'm going to be sharing with you my updated morning skincare routine. I'm going to be announcing the winners of my last giveaway. That's three $100 winners. And yes, I do provide the money for those. I've been asked that. And give you a little update on what's going on with Jim. And today the only thing I have on my face is some lip gloss and mascara. That is all that I have because I think when I talk about skincare, I need to have nothing on my skin. And I'm a slacker. What can I say? Last October, I had my 70th birthday and I was great having a 70th birthday and I still am. I really am blessed. Don't feel any different. It just sounds different. But those of you who have been with me for, a, well, over 10 years, I don't enjoy skincare never did. I do it because it has been effective. I've never had any type of procedure, anything, gone to, you know, spas or any, I just, whatever I do, I do at home. And I don't, if I didn't do YouTube, I'm not sure what I would be doing. I really don't. I know I would take care of my skin, but I may not be using all the things that I'm using. But I knew I wanted to have fewer steps. And something that has helped me with that is my mask, my LED mask. I bought a an Omnilux LED contour mask last, well, it'll be two years in May. And it has really been beneficial for my skin. It took me a while. I've got a playlist I will put at the end of this if you want any more information. But to me, it has done wonders. I still do not have many static wrinkles. The static wrinkles are the ones that stay. I've had these wrinkles, these lines, for a long time. These are better than they used to be, but I mean, I've always had, it's probably the last 30 years, but as far as around my eyes, I don't have them. When I, when I smile, I have wrinkles, but when I don't, they still aren't etched. And I did have etched in wrinkles, what, the static wrinkles right there, right there, a real deep one right in through here. And inside my marionette lines, there were wrinkles that I had 10 years ago that I don't have anymore. My mask is guaranteed for two years, so I know I'm going to have it for two years. And at this point, should it quit after two years, I would repurchase the same mask. I am doing research. I've been looking. I've been comparing. I compare the specifications. All I know about is red light and near infrared. I don't know anything about any of the other ones because there's a ton of them. But for me, I just need the red and the near infrared. And I, and I also compare the wavelength and the warranty. So I found some that I thought, well, you know, this looks pretty comparable. And I'll look and the warranty will be one year. Well, I don't want, I don't want it if it's not going to last two years. That's kind of like how I am. But when the time comes for me to get another mask, I will let you know if I do go with Omnilux or if I have found something that's comparable because I know this, this one works for me. And I still believe they're going to get less expensive, but they're just not there yet. This is how I do my mask. It's 10 minutes long. I don't have the straps on right now, but I just wanted to show you that I put my hands here to keep it off my nose and also to keep this closer to my face. I love the flexibility of the mask. It, it's just easy and you know I'm a slacker. So that's, uh, that's how I do it. There's a strap that goes around the back and Here's a strap that goes around the head. I just don't change it. I just slip it on my head and, and that's it. So this mask has enabled me to pare down the products that I use. And I'm just gonna go ahead and go right through this and tell you exactly what I do. Now, I think this is so easy for me. It, it's just a very few steps. When I get up in the morning, when I go to the bathroom, I get a clean, cheap washcloth out of my cabinet and I get it in with warm water and I press it on my face. Rinse it out and then I just start working it around my face gently to exfoliate. If it's Monday, Wednesday, or Friday, 
I use a product I've used for eight years, but I only used to use one drop of this. Now I use three drops every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And it is the Skin Diva 20% Argerline with Metrixyl 3000 and Hyaluronic Acid. And I wouldn't have thought to use this, but my friend Cheryl from Free Range Diva, she uses it all over her face. And I have only used one drop for eight years and I used it like here, 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 and around my eyes. And I thought, well, I can omit the Metrixyl 3000 and the Hyaluronic Acid that I have purchased for years from Timeless and see what this does. So I just used three drops and I don't know, I bought this on January 28th, 2023 and so far so good. I made these changes in the fall. I've been real pleased with my skin. So that's one product. I'm done in the bathroom. So if it's Tuesday, Thursday, or Saturday, I just, after I've wiped my face off and it's still a little damp, I go into my kitchen and I get the Timeless Vitamin C plus E plus Ferulic Acid and I put it on my face. And I use three or four drops and I am doing my neck now. And those drops go a long way. So I'm using about half as much because I'm only using it three times a week. And so far, so good. The Skin Diva has a really good vitamin C serum too. And so does Dermatology. It's, uh, it's, it's formulated differently, but it's a good one. But it's quite a bit more expensive, but not like crazy. But it's, it's still a really a good one. So when I go back in my dressing room, I have changed my Timeless uh, Hydrating Eye Cream to the morning because I made a change in my evening skincare, and I will do that one next time. I've used the Timeless uh, Hydrating Eye Cream for nine years, and I love it. And I just pat it around my eye, and it's just good. What can I say? It helps me. And then I have a choice what I want to do. I, I either use the Dermatology physical tinted moisturizer. I use one pump. It does have an SPF, but in order to be effective as an FPS, I think you need a quarter of a teaspoon, and that's quite a few pumps. Or sometimes I'll use a little bit of the, the Skin Diva Hydrating Diva Moisturizer, and just I just use a tiny bit. And sometimes I don't use anything, and I do buy all my own products. That's because that's what I want to do. So in the morning, I only use one serum, either the Argerline or the vitamin C plus C plus Rulic Acid, and it's worked, I think, really well. Time will tell. I have do, had a few little changes. In October, I went to the doctor, and I went back in January. And th through Thanksgiving and Christmas, I lost 12 pounds. And I know it's just... I haven't been as hungry and just a lot of things, you know, that have gone on with Jim. So, and I use a CPAP machine. So those things can affect your skin, you know, your mask, it rubs my cheeks and makes them red, but that's okay. So I'm thinking, especially for losing, I think I've lost like 14 pounds now that my skin's held up pretty good. Uh, but it's okay if it wouldn't, it would be just fine. We have an up upcoming appointment in St. Louis, and then a couple weeks after that, Jim has another appointment in St. Louis with two different doctors. And we aren't going by ourselves, the first trip anyway. Jim's son is going with us. I, we had a lot of people volunteer to go. I probably won't know anything to report until maybe not even next video or the next video, I'm not really sure. I pride myself in really being good in replying to comments. I don't know how good I'm gonna be in the next month, we'll just see. I think on the people that I watch and love your videos, I always watch your whole video and I'm just gonna put a one or two words and that's it. Because it's, sometimes it's not so much the time I don't have, it's that my brain's not working the way it should be. It's on a million other things. So I'm going to try my best to reply to the questions, make a short reply to my viewers that are so wonderful to leave comments. But I, I don't I don't know. It just it just all depends. We appreciate the prayers 
and the good thoughts so much. We really do. I read Jim the comments, and uh, he's he's just so surprised how encouraging you all are, and you are encouraging. I want to announce the winners of my last giveaway, and I will. It's a hundred dollar e gift card or PayPal deposit to wherever I can get it. And I'll go ahead and start with the first one. And the first winner is Glenda Phillips. Congratulations, Glenda. The second winner is Barbara Orr. Congratulations, Barbara. And the last winner is Irina Idaho. Congratulations, Irina. Be sure to put a comment below if you're a winner and I'll let you know what email address I want you to get back to me using that email because I try to keep everything in one place. My normal, what I do normally is I am off computer phone at five o'clock. So if you see this later in the day, I won't be getting back to you until the next morning if you're a winner. So if you don't hear from me, you know, that's what's going on. I hope you all have a blessed and lovely Palm Sunday and Easter next week, those who celebrate Easter. It is all good with God in my life. I, hey, I can do anything. Thank you so much for watching, for, you know, I just feel so supported by all of you and encouraged. And I will see you in my next video. Take care. And if I, I usually, my norm, have a little chit chat because it, it, it's, but we'll, but you know, that's basically, or especially, anyway, I don't know about that. But I knew I wanted to make it about it, but it, congratulations.